So what we're gonna do is we're gonna connect uh, this relay, right, with a remote starter. There's a remote starter that uh, we can activate to short circuit the battery. And hopefully, if all things go well, it blows up. Okay? Okay, let's go. Okay, so we're gonna, okay. Start. Press. Right. So, hopefully this works. Okay, so the short, the short circuit method didn't work. Um, so what we're gonna do now is go conventional, brute force it, right, by um, just lighting it up on fire, and hopefully uh, it's able to, uh, you know, cause a a burnout in the lithium batteries, right? Yeah. Okay, so um, we're going to light it up like that. Okay, as you've seen, we have double barreled this for extra protection. So one uh, small metal can here, and then one bigger tin here. Okay, and we're gonna get our little portable fire extinguishers here, uh, just to see how effective they are against lithium fire. Okay, let's go. E-bike, throw your e-scooter aside, gives you time to get better cover to, uh, to safety. Right, so lithium with the high density charge that it actually holds, it would take a long time to actually um, you know, kind of disperse out all its energy. So you can see, even when it's fully soaked in water, it's still bubbling up, right, it's still reacting inside, uh, it's still bubbling. So this will take quite a while, right? it's going to take few hours before it actually um, you know, completely discharges everything. 